Windsorized gingerbread house. Three quarter cup of butter. Um, seven eighth cup of uh, packed light brown sugar. One teaspoon lemon zest. One and a half te tablespoons of lemon juice. Half cup of molasses. Two eggs. Three cups all purpose flour. Two teaspoons baking powder. Uh, one tablespoon all ground ginger. Two teaspoons all ground allspice. Six egg whites. 14 16 ounce packages of confectioner's sugar sifted. Directions. One, first cut out thin cardboard, a side wall, uh, four, four um, half inch by eight inches, um, an end wall, four half inch by five inches, um, a triangular gable, four, uh, no, I, I read the instructions wrong, sorry. First cut out in a thin cardboard, a side wall, um, four and a half by eight inches, an end wall, four and a half by five inches, a triangular gable, four and a half by three by three inches, um, and a roof rectangle, uh, four and a half by nine inches. Take the tape the rectangular end wall piece to the triangular gable piece, match the long side of the triangle, uh, four and a half inches, uh, to one of the four and a half inches on the end wall. In a large bowl, number two, in a large bowl, uh, cream, butter, and sugar until light and fluffy. In, stir in lemon zest, um, uh, lemon juice, and molasses. Gradually beat in two eggs. Sift the flour, the baking powder, and spices together. Stir into cream mix mixture. Wrap dough in parchment paper and refrigerate for one hour. Number three, turn out dough into a lightly floured surface. Divide into six portions, two slightly larger than the others. On a lightly floured surface, roll out the four smaller pieces to approximate approximately the size of the sidewall and the end wall with gable templates. Cut out two of each. Roll out remaining dough and cut into two rectangular roof pieces. Transfer gingerbread onto greased baking trays. In a preheated um, 375 uh, Fahrenheit 195 Celsius, 109 Celsius oven. Um, bake gingerbread for 10 minutes or until crisp. When removing from the oven, leave the gingerbread on the baking trays for a few minutes to set, then transfer to wire racks. Um, leave out overnight to harden. Number five, in a large bowl, uh, whisk, lightly whisk uh, two white egg, two egg whites. Be gradually beat in approximately five cups confectioner's sugar. The icing should be smooth and stand in firm peaks. Spread or pipe a nine inch line of icing onto a cake board and press in one of the side walls so that it sticks firmly and stands upright. If necessary, spread or pipe and a, a, a little extra icing in along either side um, to help support it. Take an end wall and ice both the side edges. Spread or pipe a line of icing on the board at the right angle to the first wall and press the end wall into position. Repeat this process with the other two walls until they are all in position. Leave the walls to harden together for at least two hours before the putting on the roof. Spread or pipe a thick layer of icing on top of all the walls and fix the roof pieces in position. The roof should overlap the walls to make the eaves. Pipe or spread a little icing along the crest of the roof to uh, hold the two pieces firmly together. Leave overnight to set firmly. Six. When ready to decorate, uh, make the remaining icing. In a large bowl, lightly whisk um, four egg whites and mix in remaining uh, confectioner's sugar as before. Use this to make snow on the roof and to stick various candies for decoration. Finish with a fine dusting of sifted confectioner's sugar.